Oh, that's it? Yeah. Yeah, mine look nice, man. Look nice. Yeah, my respect. Oh, jeez! Oh, oh, get it, get it, get it! Oh, God! Oh, my God! <laughs> I'm on the I'm holy to this set with like this and the breeze. Just take it out, of my hand. I mean, I want to hold it too, yeah, too yeah. firm to go crush them up. Right. Hey, guys, what's up? What's up? Welcome back to the Delphi family vlog, you know? Yep. So we, we just came to the beach. You know, that little chill vibe in the evening here, you know? Yeah. Yeah. Some yeah. Yeah. So, I mean, the vibe not bad. No. A decent amount of people are here. We spoke man team, so yeah, man. persons are venturing out again. Yeah. There, I mean, on the beach is like them circle all of the sea. Them, yeah. If we had known, we would have brought our our chairs. You know, but it's all right, I guess. Yeah. Mm. Still a good vibe. Considering all things considered, the fact that you were you've been at home for so long. You know, yeah. that's why you have to come on the beach. Yeah man, anything we can get, you know, we, yeah. we work with it, right? <laughs> I mean, do you see anything I get to set out? It's so outdoor, in, you know, outdoor keep again. Yeah man. Like any little events, you can, you can grab a hold of. Like, we didn't expect to see so many people out. Right. Because, you know, it's a weekday. Yeah. But, yeah. Watch your waves crashing. One of the favorite things for me to do, you know? Yeah. Yep. You know? Yeah man, we don't really do much. We don't go nowhere. More yeah. than so hardly. Yeah. You know? Yep. Yeah, so I mean we gotta come get some of this sea breeze. They kind of overcast because I mean that right there is a good one hour left of the uh, sunlight, you know. But you know, overcast they look kind of dark. Yeah. Yeah. It's a nice beach day still. Every day in Jamaica is a nice beach day. <laughs> yeah, that is true. That's true. And that's the benefit of living in Jamaica. One of the benefits. Yeah. Both days are nice. I remember, like, as a kid, when your parents they finally say, Alright, let's go to the beach. Like, there was such a big anticipation. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Who remember that? Who remember that anticipation when your parents say, Beach time. Yeah, man. And then start to share the food. Like, my mom used to share food. Share food, you know, my 
some peas, baked chicken, yeah. cake or pudding, fruit, juice, water and sometimes we just say mommy left the food and just come. Oh, man. <laughs> You yeah, man. just want to go and reach the beach and you reach the beach and then you just in the water all day when you come back you're black <laughs> Yeah man, it's an it's a, it's a event you know going to the beach It is like it is such a, a serious event, event. Yeah, but now we are Look at that view babe, look at that view okay. Nice son okay. What is the people, this is nice, this, this is, is nice is Nice, nice man Man, nice evening out. A nice evening out, you know. You know me, I was a different member. Uh huh. We saw a video. We're, we're watching another um, YouTuber. So we're really into the African YouTubers. Like, if you are an African YouTuber, like, you know, yeah. Just to you, we are really enjoying you guys' videos. True, right? true, true, true. So, they, you guys give us a, a, a different perspective than what they show mm -hmm. about Africa and we really appreciate it. True so I was an African YouTuber and they were on the beach and it's so surprising to see how their beach actually looks in the beach in Ghana, I think the beach in yeah. Ghana yeah. looks very similar to ours and you know on Elsa Beach, anybody know Elsa Beach, them always have the little horses on the beach that you can ride yeah. on the back yeah. that was also happening on that beach and I was like what a similarity, you know? So, True. Yeah. yeah man, like there's a a guy called Wodemeyer. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, man, him uh, opened the, you know, the eyes of the world because on TV, normally all they see of Africa is just, you know, like fly at the kids' mouth and poverty, you know, hungry people. Yeah, that's what them, that's what them broadcast, the that's what they portray, you know, of yeah. Africa. Yeah. But, I mean, looking at, you know, their, you know, from, from, from their lens, from their camera lens, the African camera lens, it looks so much different. You know? Because they're showcasing their country and what and all the beauty that they that they do and then they look at their country and there's so much similarity with Jamaica. Uh, you know, there's so much similarity with Jamaican true, true. or marketplace. I remember the first video that, that we did that got us really in tune to this whole African stuff was this guy, I don't remember his name. But he did a comparison. I think he was Jamaican. He was Jamaican living oh, in England. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And he did a comparison with Jamaica and to Ghana. Ghana. Yeah. And then he was saying that, yo, I went to Ghana and I could not believe the similarities of mm -hmm. Ghana with yes, Jamaica. Yes, and then yes. he went back and he did a complete video. He showed their marketplace, he showed mm -hmm. their transportation. Mm -hmm. Like, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So, they give us all kinds of Huh? Of us? Oh, we, we, we're not really. You have to print, have to print it. Nah, it's okay. Oh. Uh huh. How much? How much you charge? Five hundred. Oh, what kind of lens is that? No, what kind of lens? The lens. Okay. Oh. Uh. Yeah. So I mean, yeah, man, this camera guy, you know him. Film business, uh, take pictures on the beach. Yeah, yeah man. Uh, you know we're gonna try to support him. You know, I yeah. give him a strength, man. That's it. Yeah, yeah. What, what are your name? Arthur. Arthur. Yeah, man. All right. Yeah. Um, yeah. I guess that is a nice background. It's right there, yeah, sir. Yeah, yeah, I love this part, you know. Yeah, man. Could I work? Could try to somewhere. Yeah, hey. Right back guys. Yeah, how is that? Wanna like it? Just one. <laughs> yeah man, look good, look good. Yeah man. Stay a good man. 
Yeah. 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 One more. All right. I mean, that guy is a, is a nice little business, you know? So he got the camera and he print them same time. Which is not, not novel, it's not new. Something I've yeah. been seeing over the years, but I mean, I have a DSLR camera and him, him have him, him print away him go and print for comeback, you know? Yeah. Yeah, because a lot of times, you know, we go out, generally, people, we, we go out and, you know, we don't get to take pictures, you know? So it's good when we can capture memories and have them printed. And then, and then too, sometimes, most of the time, we are taking um, images and it's a soft copy that we have. True, so, true. But we can have one, I'm like, alright, I automatically know which picture frame I want to put that one in. So we have a couple of picture frames that we really need to fill in. Yes. You know, yep. So we're on the rock. Yeah. Next time we'll come to the beach, we'll make sure we bring our, you know, we cheer. Yeah. But we don't mind. Nice. We don't mind this rock still, but now every time you have. A comfortable rock and it's available. Yeah. A really good vibe. the breeze and take it out of my hand. I've never want to hold it too, yeah, too yeah. firm to go crush them up. Alright, hold it first, please. <laughs> Cheers! <laughs> That's good. Gun was talking for some. You look at what you've gone, guys. <laughs> Thank you. Take care. Bye-bye.